everyone in year five, welcome to your spelling lesson. Um, today we're going to be having a look at creating nouns using the itty suffix, so we're putting it on the end of the word. Here are our spelling words. How have these nouns been formed? So these are nouns, how have they been formed? Well, we have added the itty suffix, making them into nouns. So they used to be adjectives, being curious is an adjective, able is an adjective, active as an adjective, sensitive as an adjective, and we put the itty on the end to make it a noun. An activity is a thing, a being active is an adjective. Let's sort them into the correct place in the table. So in the community, do we drop the e or the al at the end of root words? So is it communal or commune? Let's see. We drop the e or al. Do we drop the uh, at the end of the root word for adding inity? So we have communal and commune. A commune is a place where people live. Communal is a place where people share things. Curiosity. Let's see what we drop. Oh, this will work. We don't need to drop anything because the root word is curious. Ability. We drop able. Oh, at the end, eternity, we drop eternal captivity. We drop the E for captive, activity, we drop the E for active, sensitivity, we drop the E for sensitive, possibility, we drop the all, possible, flexibility, we drop the all, flexible, oh. Oh. and visibility, we drop the all for visible. Sorry, they've all just gone. Oh, let's see if I can quickly put them back. So the word that doesn't fit is curiosity because that we normally have curious, not curious or curial or curial. So you just need to learn that. So our adjective is curious and then we turn it into curiosity. You just have to know that one. Here are our spelling words. So a community is a group of people. A curiosity is when you are curious about something, you want to know something more. Ability is when you are um, able to do something, you have the ability to do something. Captivity is when you are captured, hence captive as well. It's when you are um, in a prison or in somewhere where you're held captive. Activity, when you're, when you're doing something, doing an activity like spelling or reading or football. Sensitivity comes from sensitive, so if you've got sensitivity, you're... Um, more aware of something, you might be more emotional. Possibility, something could happen. Flexibility can happen whenever. Visibility, how well you can see. And eternity, um, like something that never stops. So could you please write down the spelling words to practice this week? Um, making sure you write them four times each and practice them because we'll be doing our spelling test on Friday. Can you also, if you finished, write me um, Three sentences, you can choose which words you use for each sentence. I hope you have a lovely rest of your day and I will see you all soon.